Hey everyone, Sir Jellybean here. We are back with Court Arms Gates for Osfront Hardcore USA Conquest with Liberation DLC. It's Operation Day 24, and we are back on the defense. I'd say that quick because I was forgetting what to say. So, last match was a pretty good assault, if I remember correctly, quite brutal. And now we're on the defense, and I'll go straight into a deployment. We've got two rifle squads, a medic and a bazooka team. Wave two, we've got the M4E3, M4A3E2 with the 76, and a 101st Airborne squad. Wave three, we've got another M4 and the 105 HMC, the beast. Wave 4, we have the Cal Calliope, which is a beast. It's pretty decent shield as well. And we've got the M4, 76, and the tank through. And wave 5, we've got two rifle squads, and 101st Airborne, and M4, two supply trucks. And support-wise, we have 200-pound bombs and three medium mortar strikes. We've got tons of firepower. We're defending here at two-star risk, 200 man power, 900 munitions. And the map is Hist Urn, which is that big kind of estate compound. So it should be an interesting one. And I'll see you in combat in a moment, gentlemen. And here we are in combat. So there's three objectives to defend. We have objective C, and it's very kind of good um, fortified dugout position. This will be useful. We have objective A in this compound, so we can get the troops in the buildings and set up some fire kill zones. And objective B in this kind of wood piles over here. So we've got quite a decent setup objective wise. We're going to start spawn stuff in. Let's do it quick. Oh, we can spawn a lot in. So what we're going to do, rifle squads are going to come to the main point up here. Airborne squad is actually going to go here because it's the furthest point away. Actually, what we'll do is we'll split one rifle squad off down here. We, are, we have large defences, so we've got quite a lot of firepower support. We also get tank crew in here. Sherman-wise, the Calliope. Let's get him back here for now. We will split up some Shermans. We'll get one on the main road up here. We'll get another one to drive up to here. We'll get another one down here. We also have the self propelled gun. Let's set him up in there. We also have the medics. Put one there. I imagine there'll be a lot of death maybe happening over here. Defensive wise, <coughs> I think they'll come from the northeast and the northwest, so they're going to be over along the whole line of engagement. We do have MGs, I believe, so. You got some MGs? So got infantry? Can't see, actually, let's make that a bit bigger. Let me see, one sec. Um, I think we've got. Oh, we've got a gun system there. Brown and stuff, so that's not a bad spot. We've got a little bit of firepower knocking about, which is nice. Um, so that's cool. We'll get a nice shot of the uh, troops heading into battle. And that'll do love, love that as a cool looking shot. Definitely very cinematic. Very cool, very cool. <coughs> the OBS is picking up nicely in the lip. <coughs> Sorry, my throat's a bit phlegmy. I've not got a cough, just I think because I'm drinking a bit of coffee. So you'll have to bear with me. I apologise for sounding like a dying goat herder. A wee pause there. So yeah, we're just getting the troops set up in the position. What we'll do is we'll dig a few of these guys in around the point, as you do. And people keep saying, look, just do the massive shift, dig foxhole thing, and then press K to disband the squad. I think I'm going to try it. But look, they all run to it. It's annoying. They all run to the one foxhole. Will they do it independently? No. See, they're all running. It doesn't work. They all run to start digging it. It's stupid. I do not trust the AI, they are morons, absolutely moronic, so we will just dig naturally. We do have some natural cover as well around these positions, we have armour, we have positions we can take advantage of, so we shall take advantage of them. Over here, over here good sir, got some nice positions we can take advantage of, let's get some stuff set up. Um, look at all this beautiful cover, nice beautiful cover man. So there's a few guys here who can spread out. Whoa. Spread it. Look, why don't you just stand and look over the sandbag like a normal human being? What are your or if you've watched Drive, a normal human being. Oh, beans. Jelly beans being yes, the best beans of all. Uh, oh, the MG's going to be there firing, so we probably shouldn't stand there. Let's fall back a bit. Yes, sir. Let's just dig a few guys in. Oh, we do have this nice black machine gun there. Any orders, sir? Let's just hope that the endless hordes of Germans and Finns that get sent towards us are cut down in rapid succession. Graffle grenades, get them set up kind of around the position. SMGs, get them set up a little bit back, so if they start storming, they'll just cut them down. And, and yeah, there we go, that's cool. Tanks are in decent spots. Does it, oh, we need someone to jump on the 50, that's a shame. <coughs> Sorry about you, you got to get borrowed. Need to jump on that 50, yep. Uh, how about you? Yep, one of you is going to jump on the 50 for sure. Um, Calliope's at the back. <coughs> we'll move the Calliope up a little bit. So I've got a gun. Alright, well. 
So lovely. We've got all the armor ready. Troops are already set up in nice positions. <coughs> We've got a lot of AI support, which is cool. Yeah, get medics ready there. Tank crews there. That's not a bad spot. We'll pull the tank back a little bit. The MG is kind of a weird spot. It's a good crossfire. We don't do we have any more MGs up there. We do have this brown in. Over here is probably the more frontal position. As more troops come, we will all do as much as we pull the tank back towards the wall a little bit. So ready to uh, pop out as needed. Choose the, choose the cover and hide him a little bit. Awesome. There you go, Damage the world behind me, it doesn't matter. <coughs> Excuse me. Go in. Yes, and spread these guys out a little bit. There we go. Good stuff. Good stuff. But yeah, we've got some nice uh, overlapping fields of fire from the Calliope. We push him up a little bit. Maybe here. Oh, it's actually reloading its rockets. That's a pain in Must not reload for the last match. Supply trucks will be there soon enough, though, to provide some support. Yeah. No, no one's in my room. Sorry about that. The new kitten has gone missing. Because, well, if you know one knows, my mother we had a cat recently die, or that couldn't look like. Mother decided to get two new kittens. In her own words, I'll look after them like a child. And now she has lost one in the house because the women. <laughs> yes, sir. yes. So, it's my they've lost a cat in the house. God knows. If you hear rumbles, that is a massive tractor. Uh, or combine harvester outside as I live in the countryside which is pretty awesome at the same time kind of loud surprisingly <laughs> I do like this thing and this thing being one of my favourites so far and that boss was just being extremely deadly but yeah we're just waiting for the rest of the reinforcements to go I think you should be able to spawn everything in we'd have quite a lot of callings and they can probably hear my father there screaming his head off because for some reason Shouting louder will obviously make the cat stand English. <laughs> yes, this is my this is what I feel. It's okay. It's fine. Got the 50 man. Yeah, it's only 50. So the 50 is all mounted. Ooh. This, this actually has quite a lot of 50. Why is that 50? I hate how some things are partially loaded. That is disgusting. Get stuff reloaded. That is not healthy. Jesus Christ. Things should be automatically reloaded after battle. That is just disgusting. Not happy about that. Order, sir. Reload. 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 Ready to go, sir. 50 reloaded. With the Clypey. Well, well, I mean, you still need to run some of your bullets as well. <clears throat> oh, so we've got n nothing in the stockpile, maybe. No. So we do need the supply trucks for sure to come to him. We're just going to hang here and wait. <laughs> just enjoy the view for a little bit. <laughs> Excuse me. So yes, and me and Smiley Ghost, if this episode is released by them, we'll be going to Boventing Tank Museum soon, so you'll see some really cool tank pictures. Oh my god. I've been at work since like five million. Here we go. The show is about to begin. <clears throat> the enemy is upon us. Let's get this tank a little bit out. I like how the 50 can pop over stuff. It's a really tank set. That tank is also ready to engage. Oh god, it's preparing fire. Calliope is ready to unleash its deadly salvo. If oh, this could get dicey. We may need to turn your guns there. We do need to get some infantry maybe up with him. Let's get a couple of there's a riflemen. Let's just set a couple of guys up so we've got some sight. Oh, and here we go. The first contact has arrived. It is a armored car. Brave yet foolish. Just showing it engage. Boom. I think it missed. Did you actually miss? Yeah. As you can see in there, 50 can engage. Oh, what did it hit? Tree? Oh, I hit the wall. Whoa! Marder out of nowhere just smashed me. It's engaged. It's in oh, crap. And Marder's just done some serious damage there. Where's the self-proud gun? Fire it. 
Let's call a mortar strike in on it as well, just in case. Some more be vulnerable. That shiv just got absolutely hammered. We pull back. Box smoke, you can turn the turret, go on to turn the turret, quick. There we go, we can mortar barrage. Out right there. Yeah, if we hit it, oh. Is this thing still firing to keep engaging? The mortar barrage is coming in quite lethally. Oh, deep grip, we can. Oh, that was a good hit there. So the mortar has moved. We're not in line of sight anymore. So it's been popped. Oh, he's there. Let's try and engage. Oh. Rounds away, rounds away. He is coming into the kill zone. Oh, we do have more. Oh my god. Reinforcements have arrived at kind of an odd spot. Let's just get these guys with 50 calibers loaded. Like, let's get a rifle squad down here. Let's get that airborne squad down there. Let's get this other rifle. Oops. Another rifle squad down here as well. Supply trucks, one to there, one to there. Let's get this tank to push up. Um, pushing down this way, shall we? Let's bring up a bit there. Oh, this, this is actually still kicking. Where's the tank? Three tank crew in it. We'll get you to repair it. Where's the calliope? We may use some of these um, repeats. Um, there's quite a lot of infantry and stuff down there, let's just start spraying some rounds. And we'll do some damage. Oh, it actually hit the tank. Oh crap, that's one of those big rocket tanks. That ain't cool. Well, we just lost some stuff for sure. We just launched directly at us. We're now in a rocket fight. This is literally a rocket throwing contest. On either side, this is pretty awesome actually. Keep engaging if you can. We're even trying to shoot this thing. Oh, is it stuck in? Oh, we need to get the beard. Just pop smoke for now. This thing's doing some serious hits on us. You see him there? Three, two, one. One second, I'm going to call in there. Strike script. Try and finish off that tank. And more vehicles and light stuff clean to engage. Infantry forces have now joined us. Got the airborne, spread them out. Rifle squad there. Come into the field, spread out, the tanks will provide cover and fire, get to the hedge row. Down here we do have another rifle squad somewhere. Down right here. Come up here. I'm dead. Let's go up here for now. There is armor on the road, I hope you're engaging. That is a that's a Panzer 4 hour stage. Hit. Push up a little bit and try and engage. Reload, reload, reload. Let's go. Oh, we've got an armored cut hard trip as well. He's hit. 50 loaded, quick. Oh, crap, stop, stop engaging, quick. Look at those 30 calibers popping, come on. Down. Oh, that, that's a st stronger shoot, so is it Joe Panzer? You know, but we need to load quick. Oh, crap. Use the half trucker's cover, quick. Use the half trucker's cover. Quick, go, go, go. Quick, quick, go. Oh, yes. I think it just got out of its line of sight there. A little bit low for it. And the aircraft find the bottom run, crap, that's not good. Just hit it point blank. Let's get close to this Jake Panzer. Pop smoke, try and light the son of a bitch on fire. Put around straight through the side of it. No, we can't. Go blank. I bounced. Crap. Oh, that went cool. I lost the main gun system. There's more. Oh, there's a pack of something behind it. Where the hell is that aircraft? Oh, crap. Where's the. Where's the 50? Crap. Oh, crap. What's it bombing for? Is it going for the priest? Crap. Run. Drive it, drive it, drive it, drive it, drive it, drive it. Oh god, that was a big hit. We lost the artillery piece in the truck, that ain't cool. I get these infantry push forward. The tanks are just provide some support, fire support. Yeah, I'll catch them on the side here, which is good. Is that Panzer there? Pan that's a tank destroyer. There we go straight through it, reload, reload, reload. Let's keep those rounds pumping, keep up the fire, keep up the pain, keep up the pressure. There we go. Oh, that's a kaboom. That's a big boom. That's a lot of German armor just cooking there. I do like a German armor cooker off. It's pretty badass, good stuff. That is artillery back there, is that a... Oh, that is an artillery... Oh, that is a big-ass pack. Well, the mortar barrage will come in. No wonder the tank suffered some death. What is that there? St some kind of armored car? Oh, a stummel. Quick. 
Mortars are inbound, hopefully they will finish off the target. Has he been repaired yet? Yeah, repaired. Yep, yeah, we just took out one of the gun systems. We have to try and salvage that, it's a pretty good gun system. Um, oh crap, what the hell's that? Oh, that's a Jag Panzer one sec. Oh, we've got the rocket barrage, three, two, one, zoom in, fire. Move the area, move the area, come on. Get an airstrike in the script. Oh! Is that the rifle grenade? Holy crap, it blocked the stumble. Right. Return fire only, start crawling up to the marder. That Jag Panzer's pretty badly damaged. There's an airstrike coming in. I think he's going to finish it off. Please do it, let's get rid. There's the bomb. Oh, that's another big explosion. We've got Panzer IVs. So I've not seen any Tigers here. It seems like they're going for the, the old reliable Panzer IV, but don't worry. It will still die. With a nice kind of um, crossfire setup, kind of a um, kill zone. This is nice. That's a hit. That's a stun. He might even disable the tracks. Let's reload. Straight for the turret. Leave us some ammo storage in there. That's a hit. Has that guy got close to the Mardi yet? I think he's dead actually. There's no rifle gun in there, guy. Oh, no, we're going to continue though. There's stuff to capture. Take the rifle gun and him up, and we're going to start trying to push up some troops. Maybe the riflemen we had. We had quite a lot of riflemen over here. What we're going to do? We're going to advance them into the tree lines with the tanks watching. Because there are some cool things we could steal, slash, take. This guy, if you can, let's try and sneak him up to the marder around. Try and seize it. A lot of vehicles that we can actually jump in here and take. Is that a machine gun? Really? You're quite brave, aren't you? Has he been repaired yet? He has. Jump back in there. What the hell was that firing? That's a massive um, artillery piece where we can mortar strike it and then capture it. Let's get these riflemen up there. Get the tanks rolling. By covering fire. So over there, the Marder's being a bit brave. Try and, try and sneak up. I think he's hitting it with a bazooka or a grenade launch, which is kind of cool. What is that back there? There's another big howitzer or something. Mortars there, let's keep pushing, let's keep pushing. They should be killing that. Whoa, that's a never worth if you can kill it. Or is it never worth it? It is, and we can capture that. Fantastic. Keep pushing up, watch the watch the mortars. Keep going, keep going. There's mortars. Spread out a sec. Take that. Go there for a sec, cover us. We still have some tank crew that can repair some stuff, I believe we have one guy left at least. We did, he's probably dead. We can actually drop some tank crew out of these tanks once we've secured it, let's just move these up. And um, let's get some of these airborne up as well, they can push up as well. We're we'll trying to steal some of this stuff because some of it's absolutely amazing. Marder 3 there being a pain in the ass, one sec. Get him to charge the Marder at the back. Because he's just killing stuff, he's being a bit mean. We might be able to decrew this thing. I think we can for sure decrew it, holy crap. It is a big old gun system. They're quite viable. They'll get some sad, greatly needed manpower. Grenades out. Grenades out. Grenades out. Oh, I think we actually took it out. Jesus. Is it gone? No. We'll do a stop. Oh, crap. He's down. Start repairing. That's what it is we'll get. Bunch of these guys start moving up and start seizing stuff right. This squad push down there. A couple of you stay up here, rest here, push in. Uh, infantry, push forward. Defence line. Armour support. Armour support. Go out a couple of guys so they can repair the vehicles quicker. Uh, yep, yeah, repair that. Repair that. Because people have been moaning all the series, not moaning but saying, like, come on, repair some stuff. There's lots of manpower, I agree, I've probably lost out on a lot, so I shall do the brave thing, and do it. Kill him, kill him if you can. STG's down, good stuff. And we should be able to capture some nice weapons down here. There's actually a mort somewhere, did they completely destroy it? Probably completely destroyed it, to be fair. Um, so, there's another vehicle there. Oh, the Opal Blitz, I'm not bothered about that. 
There is what the hell is that thing? Oh, the infantry gun. The grill. Yeah, get repaired. Oh, the artillery piece. Oh, is it dead? Oh, the mortar barrage killed it. Son of a gun. We'll push, push up the flanks and see if there's anything left stealing. We could also steal this Panzer IV thing. Let's get a couple of tank crew knocked out of this thing. Turn them up. What is that? Oh, artillery piece. Get up there quick. Get up there quick. Start pushing the artillery piece as quick as you can. You can seize that. would be quite useful. Just get a couple of grenades deployed if you can. That should do it. Boom. We get you to repair this for us. Is he repairing the martyr? Yep, I think they got it. One guy, jump on it. Rest you push up the map. Rest you push up the map, just to check. He's repairing the martyr, I believe. No? So not to. You're not to pick up a repair kit or something. Sir. No, you're just being a douchebag. Fair enough. <laughs> it does happen. And there we're getting some nice repairs and stuff, getting some nice stuff repaired. Oh, medic, medic! Sweet. And there we go. Actually captured some decent gear. Over here, hopefully the pack did survive. Or the mortar, if the mortar barrage destroyed it, I'm gutted, because I thought I'd keep it alive, but that pack would have been... Oh, I think it died. That is a massive shame. That would have been massively useful to sell or seize. Seize. The vehicle repaired, I believe it's the half-track, jump in there. Now just a little bit, couple of minutes to wait, so just chill and enjoy the sweet sounds of the jelly bean. Just drop a text while I'm waiting. And yeah, so um Yeah, we're just um preparing all along now. Should be there soon enough. Hope everyone's having a good time. There was pretty good defense. We did obviously the airstrike thing. I may have to get some anti-air. Just because that's, I think it's the second airstrike. That was, really, that, was, that, that was a pretty bad one. But the points we'll get from selling all this stuff and using it will be massively useful, obviously. Is there something in there as well? No, I'm just using my mind. Hmm. Oh yeah, there's a mortar there. Crap. I need something to get mortar, that's useful. And I'm just waiting for other things to repair. I, I do like the Marder 3s, they're very good. So, I'll probably sell them because we have some pretty good guns. Excuse me. And I'm just waiting, waiting for the repairs. This douchebag can wait on to repair. What's your name? Christian Allen. Well, you're an idiot. You're an idiot, damn it. And, oh yeah, go and watch some cool channels. Watch Puggo, watch Smiley Ghost, watch Purging, watch Fiend, watch Saxon, watch, oh, what's his name? Super Sharpshooter, watch Gaming Grognarts, watch Infinite Wolf, watch Zero Hero, watch, yeah, I forget other people. Quicksilver Gaming, was it Quicks uh, yeah, Quicksilver Gaming. Yeah, yeah, I've probably forgot some people there. I apologise. They're all great channels. I'm playing a lot of Puggo lately as well, and Smiley Ghost and Purging. Puggo has definitely got some amazing tutorials. Smiley Ghost has amazing PvP, and Purging has some of the most beautiful edited videos known to man. Literally creating masterpieces, uh, guys, on a mission. Puggo is teaching everyone the tricks of the trade, making everyone better, and Smiley Ghost is kicking ass in PvP. And with me, he is a phenomenal player, literally saving my bacon 24-7 in that game. And that's who I'm going to Bogdan Tank Museum with. So that's pretty cool. So if you stayed this long with the episode, you've got some Sir Jelly Bean lore there. You learn a bit of background history that other people don't know. And you can say in the comments, you can give me some abuse, but like, hey, I know some things about you, son. I don't know. I'm going to tell you. <laughs> tell me something about you. Tell me something crazy. Tell me a good story. Tell me what's your favourite beer. I don't know. Let's see, let's see how wild the comment section gets. See if anyone gets arrested. Like, oh, I robbed a bank in 1962. Yeah, maybe. Oh yeah, I'm off, off on the tangent. I am liking the grill though. The grill is a badass. It's one of my favourites. The wasp is also very good. The wasp has taken a bit of a place in my heart. But I do like the grill. He's done it. Yes. I didn't even say vehicle repair. That was weird. Just waiting on you, lad. Just you. I'm quite impressed that a random infantry I can just repair vehicles. That's quite good. Yeah, actually have a supply truck still. Well, he's basically out of supply, but if he can, then resupply. 
bit of a bit of tanks or something. Last one and we're almost there. It's almost homeward bound, gentlemen. Almost. Almost, almost, almost. Hmm. And come on, Chris. Get it. Go now. Go, go, go. Drop the goddamn repair crate and get in, you idiot. And there we go, everything has been captured, and we'll finish it there. We killed 139 for 41 losses and 15 vehicles in place destroyed for 3 losses, and the big loss being the airstrike. I'll see the rearmament screen in a moment, gentlemen. And here we are, the rearmament screen has got 2,340.8 manpower, 1.2 support stars, 2,500 munitions, and 3.8 research points. So, that was pretty good, and we're obviously going to unload everything here. We did lose some stuff, which is a shame, but we will go through the German stuff as well that I captured, so the Neville. We're going to dismiss, the Marder we're going to dismiss, we're going to dismiss that. That's quite worth quite a lot. Panzer IV, the half track, I do like the grill, but this is a USA only campaign. So we've got a crap to the manpower, then we're going to rearm everything that we can. So we did lose, I think, the self-propelled gun, and we also lost the spy truck. We did, and the infantry mainly came back. We are going to look at what if we can unlock anything else. Artillery-wise, we're pretty far down the line, which is good. Um, Tank-wise... Don't think there's. Oh, is that Fury? Is that Fury? Oh, that's Flame. Flame. Oh, yes. Get the Flame Tank. Get it now. Screw the Pershings. No offense, Pershing. Get the Flame Tank. Right. So we are getting the support gun. Where's the Flame Tank? Where is the Flame Tank? And... So that's the M4A375W Flame, though. That will be very, very useful. We do need a Flame Tank. So that will provide us with some superior fires. But anyway, that was really cool. We'll be on the assault on the next one. Hope you enjoyed it. I certainly enjoyed bringing it to you. Thanks for watching, everyone. And you guys have a fantastic whatever day this release is on. I'm going to guess Wednesday. It probably isn't, but there we go. Anyway, take it easy, guys.